The aromacologists at Juniper Mason bought a domain through GoDaddy, but they were still able to connect it to their Weebly account. How'd they do that? You can quickly and easily purchase domains directly through Weebly, but if you've already purchased a domain through GoDaddy, you can still connect it to your Weebly site. Log into GoDaddy and go to the My Products section of your account. Expand the domain section, find the domain you want to use with your site, and click Manage DNS. Select the DNS Zone File tab. There are a lot of settings here, but you need only change one or two records. Start by editing the at record at the very top of this section by clicking on the pencil icon to the right of the record. Now enter one of our IP addresses into the provided box. You can use whichever of these you feel like using, unless you're using the SSL option with our business plan. Then you'll need to use the specific IP address we provide when you assign your domain to your site under settings. Otherwise, all the IPs function the same way and they all work properly. If you still find this confusing, just use this one. Now save. Next up, scroll down the page to make sure the www CNAME record points to at. If it doesn't, just edit it and change it so the record says at. Now make sure you assign the domain to your site if you haven't already. You can find this under settings. And now publish your site. It can take GoDaddy up to 24 hours to update the records with your change, though they're generally pretty speedy about it, so it should only take a few. Nothing is happening on our side when you point a domain here, so there isn't anything we can do to speed this up. And that's how you do that. <laughs>